Hello everyone, Chance here. I'm going to be bringing you some more airsoft footage. My last airsoft video got a lot of good feedback, so I figured I would bring you some more. Uh, this time it's only a 4v4. I generally play with only 6 to 12 people, just because I like playing with my friends, opposed from playing on a field, because the FPS limits on fields are kind of ridiculous, and some of them have some really strange rules, and... I just would rather play with my friends so we can establish our own rules and play that way instead of having to go to a field and play by their rules. It just gets kind of frustrating. But we're doing a 4v4 and the game type is attack and defend. And essentially we're not really attacking or defending necessarily anything. It's just you gotta infiltrate their area and kill all their occupants and then you win. Or if you defend them and kill all their attackers, your team wins. So with that being said, uh, the only rule essentially is semi-automatic only. Enjoy! I fucking ran out of ammo when I was shooting at gate. I decided to sit here for about 2 or 3 minutes and just suppress the enemy from pushing forward and I just happened to notice I heard a voice farther to the right and I noticed he was really close and if I'm suppressing the enemy they know my location. So knowing that I pushed back just a little bit and I just happened to fall into this little stream behind me. Luckily I was wearing my BDUs and normally uh, some pretty strong BDUs can withstand some uh, even weather and stuff but also like sharp objects and water just so you're not completely drenched if I was wearing actual jeans uh, I would have been really soaked but since I was wearing my BDUs I didn't really get that wet but that's just something you gotta be aware of in airsoft is your surroundings if you move locations you need to know your plan B and even a plan C I got Glenn, I got Glenn I got Glenn Taylor alright I see him back on the tree line Taylor right the tree right behind Glenn but a little to the right I got gauge, I got gauge. Taylor, little too, it should be a little bit to your right. He's popping his head out. Watch his back come out right now. Now that my team won the last round, we are now attacking them. And I just told my medic to go revive the other two members of my squad to my left. And he got taken out. So now it's just me against all other four squad members. The clicking sound you just heard is actually me hitting my GoPro with my own red dot sight. It's not me being hit by BBs. So as you can see, it's really hard to hold your own when it's a 1v4 situation and they know your location. But with that being said, this next clip is actually me sitting here for about 5 minutes. They are supposed to attack us and I had no idea where they were coming from. So as I was aiming here, I noticed an enemy to my right. And I just happened to miss him and things start to get kind of interesting.
Good job. At this point in time, my teammate takes out one of the attackers, but the other opposing attacker happens to shoot my teammate, and each person can get one revive. And knowing that, I know I have to push up right now to a different location so I can pick off both of these attackers. Please, if you enjoyed these airsoft videos, please let me know down in the comments so I know if I should make more of them or what I should change. Please, your feedback is very, very helpful on this channel. Thank you.